Good morning, everyone, and welcome back into North Dakota today. American Idol standouts Ruben Studdard and Clay Aiken are going on tour after 20 years. We are checking in with the duo via Zoom to chat about their upcoming show here in Fargo. Welcome, you two. Thank Good you very much. Hello. Yes, I am so excited to chat with you both. First of all, tell us about how you got your career started. <laughs> well, uh, I got my career started uh, a very long time ago. <laughs> on American <laughs> Idol, Ruben. That's where I got mine. What about you? I did too. And, uh, <laughs> you know, uh, <laughs> and thankfully, you know, we've been able to continue to do uh, this job. Uh, and, and we're now out celebrating the 20 years uh, since being on the show. Yes, well, 20 years is certainly an achievement. I want to know, though, when did you truly start singing together? Uh, probably on Idol, probably on the show. I mean, we, we got, when we were on Idol, there was a, uh, they did a lot of group numbers. We got to sing together. It wasn't just solos. Um, mm -hmm. And so uh, so I think that's part of what we wanted to, to recreate in this tour that we're doing. We're on, um, we uh, we do a lot of stuff together, medleys, things that, um, uh, songs that some of the, many of the songs we did when we were on the show. Um, obviously, Ruben does a lot of songs on his own. I do some of my own. Um, but we do a lot of stuff together uh, celebrating the music and trying to recreate 2003. Yes, well, you guys certainly have had amazing careers, and you mentioned a little bit about your own music. Tell us what you've been up to for the past 20 years. I mean, well, I released several albums since then, and, um, you know, continue. I have a new album that actually is coming out in January, uh, mm -hmm. so... I Ruben think is pro Ruben is very prolific. He has got, <laughs> he's had many albums. Also, you've been on tour practically nonstop for 20 years. Yeah. Um, yeah. We've both been we've both been fortunate to kind of not only with our musical careers, but also with a lot of other stuff, been able to, um, you know, use the platform we got from Idol to do things that I don't think either of us ever dreamed we'd be able to do when we were growing up in Birmingham and Raleigh. Um, not just music, like I said, but Ruben's been in movies and TV. I've done the same thing. We both worked in nonprofit work and, and public uh, service work and um, gotten to, you know, uh, talk about some of the issues that are important to us. So we've just been really, I mean, this this 20 years is a celebration. This concert, this tour is a celebration of the music that we've um, gotten to sing. But it's also just a celebration of 20 years ago, people in America gave us a platform and an opportunity to to you know change our lives in so many ways so we hope everybody i mean the folks who are there in fargo and around the country are the reasons that we're here and they're they're the folks who put us here and gave us this chance so we hope they come out and celebrate with us well you certainly haven't had an impact over the past 20 years i'm curious though how does it feel to be reunited for this tour and to sing together again the good thing about having an actual friend is that you don't have to you don't you don't get reunited for a tour. We've never been disconnected. Okay. So this is just this is just a continuation of what we uh, have been doing since we met on American Idol. We're, we're we're actually friends. We're actually brothers. And so, you know, we just get the chance to go on stage and clown around and get paid to do it. Absolutely. What more could you ask for? That is wonderful. All right, so what are you most looking forward to on this tour? The warm and balmy weather in Fargo. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're perfect. Go, we're planning on going out and laying in the sun on January 4th in Fargo, Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> well, perfect. That's wonderful. So you said January 4th. How can people get tickets for your show at the Fargo Theater? I'm sure you can go to RubenandClay.com, and there is... All, or clayandruben.com, either one, and there's all the information you need about the tickets to the show in Fargo. Perfect. And why would you really recommend folks to come out? Because it's, I mean, it's it's a it's fun. It's a reminder of a time that you know, idle. Idol, especially back, I think, in our day um, in, in 2003, was a time that people could get around, gather around the TV as a family and enjoy something together. People could sing along. Um, and we found that. We, we, Fargo is our first stop on our third leg of this tour. We've been, we, we did a leg in the spring of this past year, and we're doing a, we just finished our second leg in the fall. Um, Fargo is our first stop on January 4th. Um, but throughout this tour, we've seen families coming out 
dancing, singing along. I mean, it's just, I mean, it's a blast and it's a blast for people of all ages, we found. Even even kids who weren't born when we were on Idol. <laughs> they know the music that we're singing because we're singing kind of the songbook of, the American songbook of the last 50, 60 years. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Well, thank you both so much for joining me and we're looking forward to the tour. Thank you so much for having us. God bless. Yes, of course. Thank you. All right, everyone stick around. We have more North Dakota today yet to come after the break.